Hi, this video tutorial I will cover how to copy elements from source array to destination array. Here you can see the source array which has 5 elements 500, 600, 700, 800 and 900. And here you can see the destination array which has 3 elements 0, 0, 0. Suppose uh, I want to copy 700, 800 and 900 from uh, source array to destination array. Then uh, what I have to do is, I have to use uh, array copy method of uh, system class. And uh, in array copy method, I have to pass uh, source array and uh, starting position in the source array which is uh, 2 because uh, I want to copy 700, 800 and 900 and uh, then I have to pass uh, destination array then I have to pass uh, starting position in the destination array which is uh, 0 and uh, then I have to pass uh, number of array elements to be copied so total uh, 3 elements I want to copy from source array to destination array so I have given 3 here so once uh, this method is executed destination array will be uh, filled with uh, 700, 800 and 900. So, these elements are copied from source array. And uh, we will see one example now. Here I have declared the class uh, array copy demo. It has uh, main method. First I will run this program, then I will explain. This is the output of uh, this sample program. Here I have declared a source array, it has 5 elements, then I am calling a display array content method and I am passing a source array. This display array content method will accept array as parameter and using for each loop, I am getting each element from array and displaying the element. And here you can see the source array content. Then uh, I have declared uh, destination array and uh, size of the array is uh, 3. Then I am passing uh, destination array to display array content method. And uh, here you can see the output. And uh, destination array has uh, values as uh, 0, 0, 0. Then I am calling uh, array copy method of uh, system class. And uh, in array copy method, I am passing uh, source array, starting position of uh, source array, destination array, starting position of uh, destination array, and uh, number of elements to be copied. Then I am calling uh, display array content method, and I am passing uh, destination array. And uh, here you can see the output. Destination array after uh, copy from source array to destination array. And you can see destination array is filled with 700, 800, 900. And this is about how to copy elements from source array to destination array. And thanks for watching.